G'day guys, my name is Gareth, and of course, welcome to the YouTube studio. Today we are unboxing a windmill, a windmill for your back garden. Uh, these beautiful things right here, the age old thing that generates electricity and water uh, for, your, for your garden, you know, pumps the water. Have you ever wanted a windmill in your garden? You know, for some sort of visual interest? Show your neighbors and show your friends and hey everybody, let's come look at my garden. Look at the wind blowing, woohoo! <laughs> Well, ever since I was a kid, I've wanted a windmill, and this is what we got today. We're going to be unboxing this today. Uh, ever since um, my mum would take me to school, for example, she'd walk me to school, to and, to and from school, you know, and would walk past this, uh, you know, along the trip. It was like a 15, 20 minute trip each day, backwards and forwards, 20 minutes each day. Uh, one of the houses on my way to school, this, uh, this house had a, had a little windmill, you know, we're talking about like a five, six foot windmill. Uh, I thought that was really, really cool. Obviously, I've seen windmills everywhere, England, America, Australia, and I think they're absolutely amazing. Uh, today, we have a we have a, a uh, eight foot, this is an eight foot windmill. So this thing is not tiny. It's obviously not huge either, but I think it's probably just the right amount for some visual interest in your garden. Now, we're gonna show you what this thing actually looks like. This is pretty much what this thing looks like. Now, we will be, giving you the link in the description below for the particular windmill that I have. Uh, so I get a little kickback, it helps the channel, but you guys aren't paying for the kickback, I give you the cheapest link. It's a win-win situation. Uh, what, let's just show you kind of, you know, what, what is a windmill, everybody? Well, you know, from old Holland to farms in the United States, windmills have been used for plumbing, water, or grinding grain. Today, the windmill's modern equivalent a wind turbine can, can use the wind's energy to generate electricity. Wind turbines like windmills are mounted on a tower to capture the most amount of energy. So yeah, let's just undo this right now. And uh, yeah, let's give it a go everybody. I'm uh, really keen to see what this looks like for the very first time. And uh, yeah, today we're gonna see it together for the very first time. Can we see on that angle? Maybe we can. This is a better one. Oh my goodness. There's the blade. So obviously we won't be able to put it together in this video, but I'll be showing you the individual components and uh, you know, show, obviously showing you again what it looks like once you put it together. So we'll go back to number three again. What have we got here? Some instructions. That's gonna really help. I probably will have to read them. Uh, when I put these together. Otherwise, uh, you guys can see me a bit better now. Hey, everybody. Otherwise, I won't know what the hell I'm doing. That could be the base. Wow, take a look at that, everybody. I'll move it over here a bit more so you can see a bit better. There you go. Wow. Okay, I don't know what the hell that thing was, but this is the actual windmill itself. And it's pretty big compared to my head. It is, uh, well, you know, in some people's eyes, it could be considered small. Uh, I've definitely seen windmills much, much smaller than this, much smaller. So it's definitely got a significant size to it. Like I said, it is an eight foot windmill. And uh, yeah, you know, I think it's probably the perfect size for a garden, you know. Uh, this is a humidity. And uh, temperature, wow, that's awesome. I kind of forgot that mine came with that. You guys see that? So um, it's got two things on the back as well. I'm guessing you connect the dials to the actual, you know, meters. That's cool. What else do we have? Let's continue looking everybody. Oh, we've got a water gauge. So this thing basically gives you the, you know, gives you how, how many, millimeters or inches of water has fallen. That is awesome. Uh, I've got heaps of tools and stuff like that to put the thing together. It must be the swingy thing. Is that the swingy thing, swingy thing? I think it might be the swingy thing. That's the name for it, everybody, the swinging thing. <laughs> uh, how the hell am I supposed to know what it's freaking called? We've got some more components here, obviously, to you know put the thing together. Um, and we've got some legs, or the poles, I guess. I guess you could say the poles that, you know, 
enable to enable it to look like this. Where is it? So that's that's that would be the poles that you know hold it all together. Uh, yeah, I'm so excited to put this together. I really, really am. There is a significant amount of weight to this actually. It's very weighty, uh, not too heavy, but yeah, that is awesome. Look at that one more time. We've got something else here actually. We have more. We have another batch of weighted poles and, and you know support beams to hold it all together. Uh, I think that's absolutely incredible. I've wanted one of these ever since I was a kid. And uh, my goodness, now I've got one. Can we get it spinning with just my fingers? Well, I'm going to black out in a second. It's been nice knowing you all. <laughs> but look at that. It's spinning. It is 100% spinning. Oh my goodness, we are getting it to spin right now. That is awesome. I didn't think we would be able to do it, do this in, in this video, but we've done it. And uh, yeah, absolutely incredible. I've bought myself a windmill. Uh, in, in, in Sydney, Australia, we have something called the August winds. Whenever it's August, you know, just before, the month before August and even the month after August uh, seems to be the period where it just gets, it just gets really, really windy uh, in this part of the world. And obviously there's wind, you know, all the time on and off, but those three months, months roughly, especially August, seems to be the time when it's just way more windier. So I'm really, really keen to get that, you know, well and truly set up before that. But uh, yeah, well, I'm, I'm, when August comes, I'm going to have so much fun just sitting on my chair uh, out the back, staring at this thing. <laughs> hey, I've got nothing else to do, apparently. Uh, guys, we do have YouTube. We have do uh, have you, you. That makes no sense. We do have two YouTube channels, and uh, two has two, and one has the one. It's that simple. But yes, I do have you. Uh, I need you to give me a like and a subscribe and ring the bell. Otherwise, YouTube is mean. They won't tell you when we post something new. And uh, yeah, I guess we'll leave it at that. Thanks for watching, everybody. My name's Gareth. I've been tall, just like the sign says. And I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Daily videos, everybody. See ya. Bye.